G'day everyone, Nick Bowditch here. Um, just a quick run today. I uh, hope you're having a good Friday wherever you are. Um, I had a little message which I thought was interesting from um, someone who follows my stuff and, um, you know, follows it pretty intently, which is, which is great, and I'm really appreciative of that. But she was saying, you know, maybe I should back off a bit talking about mental health and mental illness and mental uniqueness as I refer to it as myself uh, as my own stuff um, because you know it makes her feel a bit uncomfortable and she she likes to support my storytelling stuff and whatever but you know she wasn't too keen on hearing my truth you know um, quite as much and, and I've been thinking about it all day and um, you know I, I have to say my conclusion is no I'm not going to I feel like we've only just started to have this conversation globally about the stuff that goes on in our head without any shame that I'm not going to, I'm just not going to take on anyone else's shame. You know, that's what, and that's what it comes down to. If, if someone isn't comfortable about you speaking about your health, even my mental health or physical health or anything you know if that's their stuff that's not my stuff and if people don't want to hear about my stuff they don't have to you don't have to <laughs> and I just you know I'm not going to be shamed and I'm not going to stop talking about stuff that means something to me or that's important to me or that I know is helping um, myself if not other people um, just maintain this conversation about real shit for once you know that we don't have to hide away from it we don't have to feel shame about it um, I really do believe that one day pretty soon we won't talk about mental health and mental illness we just talk about health and illness um, you know I've said this before but my, my chronic illness just happens to be in my brain my brain is different to other people's. It's no, no different to somebody who has asthma or diabetes or rheumatoid arthritis or anything else. It's a chronic physical condition. Mine just happens to be in my head. Why should I feel shame about that? I'm not going to. I'm just not, I'm just not going to. So I'm sorry if anybody doesn't want to hear that stuff. Don't follow my stuff. It's simple. Um, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to take on any loss of shame of fought my own fucking shame for so long I just I can't deal with yours so you know that's kind of it I I just feel like that's important to me and I really need to um to put that out today that and maybe it's important to you you know if if you don't want if you don't have people in your life who or if you have people in your life who don't want to hear about your stuff real warts and all the real truth your truth then maybe they shouldn't be in your life harsh but I think it's fair anyway I hope you're all having a good day wherever you are good Friday today here it is Friday in Australia at the moment um, I hope you find some kindness today spend some of it on yourself see ya